Hi and welcome to HUDKing.com, your source for real virtual tours in HUD homes in and around the San Antonio area. If you're watching this on HUDKing.com, click on the bird to follow us on Twitter, click on the F to follow us on Facebook, or click on the YouTube link to be taken to our YouTube page. While you're at our YouTube page, if you click on the subscribe button, you'll be instantly notified of new uploaded videos. Now on to the home. We are here in the beautiful west side of San Antonio in Talese de Calabra. And we're at 7918 Oxbow Way. That's 7918 Oxbow Way. A very nice three bedroom, two bath, single story home. Has a two car garage. It was built in 2015. This home is just under 1800 square feet. The exterior is brick. There's a little bit of hardy trim. This home is really almost in new in condition and it's about $14,000 underneath the county appraisal. It sits on about a 6,900 square foot lot and it's pretty much almost moving ready on the exterior. Not much work ne really needs to be done. Some light landscaping. They're actually still building new homes in this community. So this is your chance to buy a slightly used home and save a ton of money. Let's look at the backyard and then we'll look at the inside. Well, we have access to the backyard off of a door in the hallway. We step out into a nice little covered area here, a little covered patio. And then there's a little step up to the home. So exterior-wise, the back is hardy plank. The front and sides are all brick. And I'll show you right now. They're clearing some land so you don't have anybody behind you right now. But eventually, you probably will have some neighbors back here. This is nice and it's bordering on the foothills of the hill country. You can kind of see how it is a little bit hilly. So you have really a nice view out here. But exterior-wise, doesn't need any work. Let's look at the inside. Well, as we step into the home, you'll notice it has high ceilings and it does have ceramic tile through most of the home. So that's good because it's a nice neutral color. I don't think you'll need to change any of the flooring. To the right here, we have a formal dining room, a very large formal dining room that really just needs some touch-up paint. The formal dining room does have access into the kitchen, but we're going to continue through as if we came in the front door. We turn to the right here and we have your kitchen. The kitchen does have ceramic, I'm sorry, granite countertops, which is nice. Dark cabinetry. It currently does not have the range or the microwave or the dishwasher, so you're going to need to get appliances. And then we come over and then have access into that formal dining. Now in the kitchen here we have a nice walk-in pantry, really good sized pantry. Directly across from the kitchen, we have your utility room, your indoor laundry room, your washer and dryer connections are here. There happens to be a washer machine in the home right now. And then we have your two-car garage. It's a little dark in there, sorry guys, but it's a pretty standard two-car garage. It's been finished out. If we continue in, we have your family room. It's going to need a fresh coat of paint. As I said, the flooring can probably stay in the living areas, but you're going to want to change the flooring in the, in the bedrooms. You're going to want to paint this wall. You can see it's very dirty. Now over here to the left, we have bedroom number one or your master bedroom. Master bedroom is going to need a fresh coat of paint and some flooring. Has a high ceiling. The master bath has ceramic tile, which is nice, so you don't have to change that, but it does have a single vanity with matching granite countertops. And then it has a separate gar big garden tub and a walk-in shower. That's a nice upgrade there. We have your master walk-in closet with high ceilings. It's gonna need painting and flooring. And then we have your water closet or your commode. A little linen closet there. So uh, really this room just needs, rather the master just needs a fresh coat of paint and, and carpeting in the bedroom or tile, depending on what you want to do. On the opposite side of the home, we have bedroom number two. Bedroom number two is going to need a fresh coat of paint and it's going to need some flooring. Right next to that, we have bathroom number two. Full bath number two is a, is a, a granite a single vanity and a shower and tub combo. Clean and it has ceramic tile, which is nice. And then we have bedroom number three at the back of the home. Bedroom number three is going to need a fresh coat of paint and it's gonna need some flooring. So that's about it. This home's really just some touch-up paint, a little bit of flooring, and as I said, it's about $14,000 underneath the county appraisal. Instant savings. Let me give you a summary. Well, there you have it, 7918 Oxbow Way. That's 7918 Oxbow Way. A very nice single-story, three-bedroom, two-bath home, almost in move-in condition, and it's about $14,000 underneath the county appraisal. It's listed right now for only $228,000. So if you're interested in this home and you don't have a realtor, I would love to earn your business. You can reach me at 210-706-0616. My name is Jonathan. I am the HUD King, and I want to help you find your castle.